been struggling in offense this year. Kerry Collins, though, had a big game last week, trying to get his teammates back. Over the middle to Money Man, Wesley Walls, who caught five at the first down. Fred Lane, look at him go. Bianca Batuka hurt early. Fred Lane, free agent from Lane College in Tennessee. Touchdown. And Lane up the middle. Looking like MacArthur Lane. He's not stopped. He's night train lane. Except, and then what's this? The electric worm? What? The Panthers lead at 14 nothing, Tom. Yeah, and he does a great job of keeping his leg moving. You see there, he loses his balance. He spins. But look at him get down off on all threes. He keeps the legs churning and gets to the end zone. Joe Bugle is one of the best running backs in the business. But on this day, Carolina stuffed Napoleon Kaufman. Sam Mills and Chad Kodachrome stopped him behind the line of scrimmage, held him to 16 yards. And then Collins... What happens here, Tom? Well, you take a look at Eric Turner in the middle, Rob Fredrickson on the outside. They split, go to coverage, and Kerry Collins sees a lane. And that may have been just Collins doing that on his own. 21-0 lead at the time. And then Scott Green, 10-yard run, 28-7, halftime lead for Carolina. Four touchdowns on five first-half possessions make it seven on their last 11 series. Then Jeff George picked off by Sam Mills, a.k.a. Field Mouse returns it to the 45, sets up a KC 54-yard field goal, 31 to 7. Then, could it happen three times? Look at the fullback. Scott Green says, I'd like to block someone. And then Turner, like, throws Fred Lane into the end zone. Well, and Scott Green had to run a good 30 yards before he could find somebody to hit right there about on the seven-yard line oh, and Lane again into the end a zone. A nice throw into the turn end zone by Turner. Then, George sacked by Ronaldo Turnbull. He grabs his rib cage, had to leave the game. And then the real fun began. The Carolina lineman feel that Lane was already down. Watts the late hit for, and some big boys going at it. Garcia makes the first run at Chester McLaughlin, and then former teammates, and this a heavyweight bout. McLaughlin and Greg Scrippenack go on it. It's a scrap.